great. <laughs> Get out of the way, Paul. Get out of the way, Jad. I'm making a I'm YouTube. A, I'm wrestling a YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Jerkin. What were the were there any like really random weapons that were in this game? Like the big beer bot like beer the, can, or was that all no mercy? Uh, it may have just been no mercy, because oh. like, my favorite weapon was the giant cheese. Yeah, or it'd be great if, if Starving Child pulled out the giant wedge of cheese. Oh man, if I make him a no mercy, that's his weapon. This is Gary. I forgot which C is which, I think Taker is the red one. Uh, uh yeah. Yeah. I need to turn. In, I need yes. to. Yes. So no, I'll leave there was off. a spear. Uh. Yeah, I'll leave him off. Yeah, I'd turn him off. Turn him off? Yeah, it adds it add more to the drama. There. I agree. Now will the sea finish your taunts? Then this all of a sudden becomes the day of reckoning two, and it's the momentum shift, and everyone gets fucked over. And you just <laughs> fuck that mechanic. Oh, hey, there's a challenge about beating the Undertaker in a cage match. That's the oh, he hit a momentum shift and climbed out and won. Oops. <laughs> there's Candy Taker with that flying head to the everything. It's a it's a standing senton. Don't ask how it works. <laughs> ah, okay. Joey Law. What? Joey Law's here. Oh my God, he's not dead. Weren't we talking about him earlier? We were just literally talking about him earlier. No yes. joke. How are things going with Mr. Hughes? <laughs> That's what we were talking about. <laughs> Spear! Ding! Dude, shot number three. Choco Slayer. Chocolate. Knockout. Aww. That was almost our first knockout victory of the tournament. I want to see someone get KO'd with their elbow. <laughs> their own elbow hitting them. <laughs> Me! Oh, he doesn't train with that guy anymore. Aww. Well, excuse us for not keeping up to date with the person that doesn't I tell know, us anything about jerk. them anymore. You what, Mr. Dickhead. Hughes wasn't good enough for you? You could have been the bodyguard of other people. I know. Not even a one count. <laughs> Ding. Ding. Edge, once again, donating his glasses for Candy Taker in this match. Of course. Apparently, no, he wasn't good enough for it. Wait, wasn't, um, wasn't Candy Taker's first match against White Wolf? Yeah. Oh, man, he's plowing through the brood. <laughs> Somehow, Christian's going to enter into this and be the next opponent. I know. He's going to be the here comes a new fighter opponent. Bye. A new challenger. A new challenger has emerged. Ding. Well, there's spots. They're not working well together. 
<laughs> if I had a way to change the sounds, instead of a ding, it would be like a, a quack or a... <laughs> <laughs> I wish it would just literally be someone saying ding. <laughs> ding. <laughs> and then have to say it three times. Me! Oh! Ah! Oh my god! Yikes! Edge holding his leg, despite the fact I think Undertaker hasn't worked that part Candy's, of his body in about Candy's seven splash. minutes. Ding. That's copyright infringement! <laughs> well, of course you would take offense to that. Oh! Oh! Chain wrestling! Fuck you. What? You know what. No, what? The, the scorpion splash joke. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you just now got that? <laughs> no, I got it. I was just being silent out of rage. Oh, okay. I was I was mentally banning you from my life. <laughs> <laughs> I was getting a timeout from Slip Smile. <laughs> Another relatively close match. Uh, they learned something from uh, Matt Hardy and, Stokos and Starving Charles D. Austin. That's the first time that line has ever been said. They learned something from Matt Hardy. I know. Well, of course Edge learned something from Matt Hardy. Ew. Whoa! Undertaker working out a little bit. Ooh. Gotta keep those glutes loose. <laughs> Candy Taker not taking any shit at all. What else is new? Uh -oh. oh god! This could be the end of the match. It could be. We well, may have a new Hokey Pokey champion. This could be the end of the reign. It could have lasted zero matches. And it's over! Tradition, they should hang Edge from the top of the hell on so. <laughs> every, every Undertaker and Candy Taker match is ended with a tea bag. <laughs> Sugar balls. Every <laughs> time Undertaker wins a game in a video game, I only keep thinking of his theme song from uh, WWE 4 Rumble for the Super Nintendo, which is like a really, 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 really shitty 16-bit version of his classic theme. <laughs> Sounds about right. Like, the gong says like this, took like a, a stick to a pan. Ding! King. Kung. <laughs> then 16-bit funeral parlor music. It doesn't sound as good as you might think it does. No. Then this match then happens. This match happened. Should have made this a ladder, King of the Ring tournament. I don't think I could have. You know, 
those matches that take 45 fucking minutes. I think right about now we'd be getting down with Roadblock versus whoever the fuck he played in the first round. Um, it was. Mid That was two. That was like six matches ago. I don't remember. <laughs> it was a uh, roadblock and Willie too silly. Oh yes. <laughs> nice it was silly enough. of me. Nice. It was silly of me to forget that he was in that match. Almost. In fact, <laughs> it was too silly. I'll put him in here for you, wow. Slip. Wow. So you could wow. so you could hopefully see the burning hammer. Burning hammer. I don't know if he had it in WrestleMania 2000. Well he wasn't in uh No Mercy. No Mercy? So it was in really? this one. Yeah. Oh, okay. You, yeah, had, you, had, this you had to edit in the headbangers. Uh, oh yeah, because they have the fucking pictures. So it's Starving Child versus Beaver Cleavage. <laughs> They're fighting over breakfast. <laughs> It's an actual wife beater versus a guy who had to go through a, a woman beater gimmick. Ah! I might be the only person alive that actually remembers that Chaz actually actually had a gimmick. I, I remember that gimmick, and it turned out through GTV that his woman was playing was, that shit all along. Yeah, putting on makeup for it. I, I wish they had gone through the original payoff of what GTV was or who was doing it. They couldn't because he left for WCW. No, it was originally, uh, they wanted Tom Green to do that. Really? Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, GTV. Because <laughs> be he was dust. huge on MTV at the time. I thought it was Goldust. It was either, Goldust was their backup for it. And even that fell through. Yeah, and even that fell through. So, just when you think you can rely on Goldust, <laughs> Goddamn cheese dust. <laughs> One half of the camping on tacos de fajitas with uh <laughs> Thank you, Chico. <laughs> ass attack. <laughs> or flying ass or whatever. Flying ass, yes. Flying asshole? I didn't know Johnny was on a plane. Whoa! Anytime I hear, anytime I see an Enzigiri, ding. Anytime I, uh, anytime I see an Enzigiri, I keep thinking of Joey Styles' uh, commentary from Hardcore Evolution. Because it was, uh, they only had one line in the whole game for Enzigiri, and every fourth move was an Enzigiri. <laughs> Catches the foot, Enzigiri. Enzigiri. I have to say, of those like acclaimed titles, my favorite one had to be uh, WWF Attitude. Yeah, wasn't that the one with the huge roster? <laughs> yes. Yeah, head is an unlockable character. Yes. It's great because you you know who the commentary team was for that game? It was uh, Shane McMahon and, uh, and Jerry, Jerry Lawler. <laughs> Shane McMahon. <laughs> That was so good. Wouldn't they talk shit about you if you didn't do anything? Yeah. <laughs> I remember the crowd. The crowd chants in that were wonderful. Oh come on! <laughs> let's let's reminisce about other games instead of talking. Oh about no. <laughs> because we're not going to see a burning hammer. We already know that. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why? 
this interference is silly. 